Hi everyone, it's Darlene. Welcome to this week's video. I did a pretty quick card this week. I used a couple of stamps from Impression Obsession. This first one is called Gradation. And I inked it up with some black ink, memento ink, and stamped it on my Nina Solar White cardstock. And then I took a, a Sizzix oval and uh, I cut it off to the side. Then ran it through my Sizzix machine. And then um, I have this new ink called Pickled Raspberry and I'm priming my applicator on a piece of scratch paper because this ink pad is really juicy. And when you have too much ink on your ink applicator, you're more likely to get those rectangular blocks. So I'm using really, really light pressure here. And I'm starting off the cardstock and moving on to the cardstock in tiny circles. It's a really pretty color. I really like the new color here. Um, Okay, so now I'm going to take a, another stamp called Full Bloom Hollyhocks and I'm going to just take some plain water and spritz it, a lot of it actually. And then I'm going to press it down onto my cardstock and I'm going to hold it there for a few seconds and that allows the water to absorb into the cardstock and it kind of um, absorbs and um, moves around some of the ink and it gives it a really cool look. And I trim that pink piece down and now I'm going to adhere it to a piece of black cardstock, which is going to be the full size to my card four and a quarter by five and a half. And I've got this beautiful wings sizzlet and so it uh, dry embosses and die cuts at the same time. And it's got five different sizes of butterflies. It's really pretty. I've used it a number of times here on my blog. Um, I've also got uh, this stamp set called Petite Pears and it's got um, a bunch of different pairs, a sentiment for the outside of the card and a sentiment for the inside of the card. So um, I'm white embossing. As you can see, I've got this stipple brush that I use to um, wipe off any stray embossing powder that gets on my cardstock. I'm going to punch out my sentiment with an oval and I'm going to kind of make it off center a little bit because I'm going to be hanging it off the side of the card. And this is just some plain black embroidery thread. I'm going to use some Stampin' Up Dimensionals. It's just some foam adhesive to pop it up on the card. Of course, it's not exact, so I'm going to take it apart and do it again. And now I'm going to uh, adhere my butterflies. I'm just going to space them out across this oval. I'm going to put one mini glue dot in the middle of each butterfly, and that allows the butterfly to really stick to the paper, but uh, the wings look like they're flying off. Now this last butterfly is really, really tiny, um, and even my glue dot is too large, so I'm going to I just snip that glue dot in half and use it on the tiny butterfly. My sentiment is going to be adhered with dimensionals as well, and then I'm going to trim off that edge there. And that way I get kind of a half circle on one side and a half circle on the other side, and it balances out the elements on my card. And uh, I'm using another glue dot to adhere my bow. And then I'm just going to adhere this panel to a piece of folded cardstock. And then I'm going to take that sentiment that goes on the inside and I'm going to use some memento ink. And I actually mounted this the stamp backwards, or crooked, <laughs> so it's kind of messing me up there. Anyway, um, I even did it without a stamp on my jig, which is pretty amazing. Uh, anyway, that's it. So hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next week. Thanks for watching.